AI is poised to transform the mobile experience. Through the introduction of AI and machine learning technologies, we are able to boost overall network capacity and performance while minimizing energy consumption. This will produce tangible benefits for service providers, mobile users, and our society as a whole. We can use AI models to optimize a radio's performance to the changing conditions of its surroundings. This will lead to faster speeds, lower latencies, and more reliable connections. To fully realize this new AI-powered networking vision, we need to overcome the challenge of interoperability. One of the main uses of AI in wireless is for the air interface, which governs the connection between the network and the device. In mobile systems, there are multiple vendors that provide the network and the devices. The challenge is that each of these vendors can have their own AI models, and we need these models to cooperate for efficient functioning of AI. To tackle the challenge of interoperability and enable cross of the AI wireless system, Qualcomm Technologies and Nokia are using a pioneering technique called sequential training. It allows the two companies to agree on data sharing, but the neural network structures do not need to be shared. Nokia and Qualcomm have teamed up to solve this problem. This is done using the Nokia Bell Labs test network and the Qualcomm device powered by the 5G Snapdragon RF and modem system. Here in this setup, the device first collects data from the network through its connection to the network. This data is used by a device trainer to train the device AI model for the encoding. Once this process is complete, the device shares this data with the encoder output to an independent network trainer, which then trains the AI model on the network. These uh, independent trainers effectively act as translators, allowing vastly different AI systems to interoperate with each other. In a commercial deployment, there are devices from multiple vendors in the same network. Therefore, multiple AI device models exist. As shown in this setup, sequential training technique is able to support multiple encoders with a common decoder. When these AI models are deployed at the device and network side, the models work together to reinforce one another, allowing them to support high performance in wireless network. Using a common decoder across all devices performs as well as utilizing a dedicated decoder trained individually for each device. While Qualcomm Technologies and Nokia have already introduced AI technologies into current 5G networks and devices, AI is emerging as a key technology pillar in 5G advanced when it is standardized in the air interface. In the next generation of networking, 6G, AI will permeate into more aspects of the mobile communications, compounding its benefits. A data-driven air interface can learn from its environment to improve its performance and efficiency. By implementing AI into mobile networks and devices, AI will improve communications the same way AI has benefited so many other industries. We at Nokia are really thrilled to work with Qualcomm to turn innovations into standards. This type of cooperation can turn ideas into technologies with a real-world impact.